Thomas, thank you very much for the invitation to DPF Engineering, Carlo Island. Now, uh, what a wonderful investment that you've got here. But before we talk about Aroa and also the Grob machines, tell us a little bit about your background and DPF Engineering. Yeah, so um, DPF Engineering, I founded it in 2010. Um, myself, I'm from a tool making background. I was working in local industry. And I saw some opportunity to supply local industry, which is mainly med tech industry. Um, so we invested in some machines, took on some local guys, and we grew from there. In 2013, 2014, we got some opportunities within the aerospace industry. And again, we saw another opportunity there. So what we did, we went off, we got the accreditations we needed, we put in the quality management systems we required, and we started to probe the aerospace market for aerospace business. Um, so here we are like six, eight years later, and we're doing business globally. Uh, we're supplying some tier one aerospace companies, and now we're at a stage where we want to invest in high-tech machinery to be competitive globally. So our reasoning behind investing in, in high-tech equipment like this is really, you know, uh, using the spindle hours that are available within the year. Um, in Ireland, we currently have a skilled shortage, so we're trying to offset that skilled shortage by not having to employ so many people. But the people we do employ are very high-tech and high-skilled people. Um, so for us, the aerospace industry offers huge opportunity for volumes, uh, long-term contracts, uh, parts that give long cycle times, materials that give long cycle times. And for us, it's a very attractive industry to kind of to grow the business into the future. Well, that's fantastic. I mean, it, it very much is future-proof in your company, isn't it? And the aerospace market, you know, obviously it's a global market, like you say, it's very healthy. But I'm quite interested to know about Aroa. Now, there is uh, a number of different automation systems in the marketplace, but why did you choose Aroa? Um, when we start investigating this type of system, um, we went and we looked at several different types of systems. We travelled all over Europe and we looked at different systems in the field, operational. The reason we, we chose Aroa, um, we knew Aroa from our two room business. We use Aroa on some of our EDM machines and we understood the accuracy of the actual work holding. Um, and when we compared it from a, a software and functionality point of view, it just it seemed a lot more flexible um, to kind of flex with the needs that we have. We have different size parts, um, we have different types of parts, uh, which all require accuracy. So we wanted to combine that flexibility in the software with the accuracy on the work holding. And that, that's really what swung us in the direction of Aroa. And it's quite incredible, isn't it? Because uh, Aroa can actually you know, look at uh, two microns for any automation system with the, uh, the pallet systems you've got. And I think the benefit that you've actually got here is that you can actually add to this cell as well, can't you? And also change the pallet sizes. Absolutely, and that's that's was one of the main reasons, is that flexibility. Our intention is to add more machines to this system and extend the Aroa system. But we have that flexibility to go with big pallets, small pallets, add larger machines, smaller machines. So again, it's, it's, it's all that flexibility that Aroa offers combined with the accuracy. And finally, uh, for, for any aerospace companies that are looking to outsource parts into the marketplace. What's your message to them? The message is simple. We, we have the system, um, we have the hours available, we are competitive because we're investing in equipment that makes us competitive. Um, if you combine all those, those elements, so we've, we're running machines with high-tech software, we're loading with high-tech pallet loaders and the machines we're using are, are very high-end, capable, robust machines. So for any aerospace customers who have a hard metal need in particular, we're, we're, we're certainly open for business.